to test a sample to see if it has lipids, we perform something called the emulsion test. So for that, we are going to need ethanol, test tube, a rubber stopper, water, and a pipette designated for the water and a pipette designated for the ethanol and a sample. So the first step, take something, I'm gonna use this marker, and roll it over your sample until it's really pretty crushed up into small pieces. All right, then take your sample. You don't need a lot. Take a little bit of your sample and you're going to place it into your test tube. Now you can use either a solid or a liquid for your sample. In this case, I'm using a solid. So we don't need much sample. The next thing we are going to do is add some ethanol. You're going to add two milliliters of ethanol. If you look closely at your pipette, there's a line here that says number one. So that's one milliliter. So we're going to fill our pipette Squeeze your pipette. There we go. When it's out of the ethanol, so squeeze it out of the ethanol. And suck up one milliliter. See, I stopped when it reached the line. Right here. And put it into your sample. We're going to add a second milliliter. Good. Take the cork stopper, place it back in the ethanol. Take your rubber stopper, place it in the top of your test tube. Put your thumb on top of the test tube stopper. And then we're going to shake our sample in the ethanol. You're going to shake it up really, really well. Now the reason that we are using ethanol is because lipids dissolve in ethanol, but lipids do not dissolve in water. Okay. When you do this, I want you to shake it for another minute or two. All right, so we're going to place this back down. Well, as you can see, Our ethanol is relatively clear. It's a little cloudy, but not much. So place your test tube back on the test tube rack. Remove your stopper. Take your pipette that says water on it. Once again, remember, we're just going to fill the water up to this line that says one milliliter. Squeeze outside of the liquid. Place it in the water. Suck up one milliliter. And we're going to add it down the side of our test tube. All right, so that cloudy white that we see, that indicates that there is a lipid present in our sample. When you are done, you are going to take the liquid that is in your test tube and dump it into a waste container. And then go clean out your test tube. Please do not 
dump your sample directly into the drain of the sink. And there you have it, the emulsion test for lipids. Yay!